Huh? Oh, yeah, right. <clears throat> I have been instructed to tell you that the following episode contains scenes of utter stupidity, insanity, and stuff that will turn your mind into pudding. You're just gonna have to deal with it. Enjoy! episode of Game Show Carnival contains scenes of extreme and insane stunts performed by animated engines. Do not, and I cannot stress that enough, do not try any of what you see here at home. Seriously, you could get really messed up. Ladies, gentlemen, transvestites, and people of all pants sizes, welcome to the climactic return of... Game Show Carnival! If you don't know the plot by now, kiss it. And now, he is Toby! Hi, everybody! Hi, Dr. Dr. Nick! But unfortunately, he's not important enough. So here's the only celebrity our negative two bucks could afford. He's the host of Total Drama Railway, and is the only known creature who feeds on attention more than our blue star billing bastard, Chris McTrain! Well, Kaloo Kalei, every peoples, I'm your beloved host, Chris McTrain. I thought I told you there's only one room for one star building prince wannabe. I know, ordinarily I wasn't going to do this, but my agent says I got to make at least one appearance in some amateur-ass sort of game show. I seriously need to get a new agent. Didn't I see you get into a slap fight with some old lady last week? I'm the juggernaut, bitch! You suck. I was desperate! <laughs> Alright, let's get this bloodbath started. So, uh, how does this, uh, show work? It is simple, little Carveroid. My game's called Rooftop Stranding. Alright, very interesting. But how does it work? Well, we get eight of the others stranded on top of a Timmy Shed's roof. Rules, you leave, or get pushed off the roof, you lose, sucker! Oh yeah, and the fun part, they think they're playing for a million dollars, but they're really playing for... The no potential, I found this stand. You're sick, sick boy. I feel so close to you right now. Alright, now, let's meet our eight gullible, I mean, uh... Lucky Contestants! It is a time of desolation, chaos, and uncertainty. Brother pitted against brother. Babies having babies. Sarah Palin running for the 2012 elections. And cheese is spelled CH335 Batman signal. But then, on the roof of some health hazardous sheds, comes eight noble heroes. But we couldn't afford those guys, so we just have these morons instead. First, there's the star-billing bastard himself, Thomas! Your applause feeds me! It feeds us out. <laughs> and from parts unknown to highly markable, particularly edible, Percy. Do not hate me because I am beautiful. 
Next, he's big, he's dumb, but you just can't help but love him. Which is the exact opposite of true. Henry! Who said that? Are you a ghost? No, dude, I'm speaking to you via voiceover. Thomas! The ceiling is talking to me again. Shall I get the crazy bat? Up next, he's mean, he's crazy, he's German, Big Mackey, the French Can we just get this over with? Dude, don't ruin this. The audience eats this kind of cheesy intro stuff more than old CDs. I mean, Henry ate a Miley Cyrus CD once. It gave him indigestion. We got Emily James Whiff and new for this season, Dennis. Wait, don't I at least get my own intro or something? <sighs> oh please. If we gave every season 9 to 14 character of the day their own introduction, we seriously would have blown our budget by now. Enough with the PBS audience, babysitter! All eyes on me! Alright, here's the deal. The eight of you have been selected based on your intellect. <laughs> Bravery. Ah! I'll just pee my pants! And the disdain possibility that you all might kill each other. <laughs> Supposed to know that you can't roller skate through fields of pointed glass and not size spears to compete in the craziest, most mind blowing challenge ever. The rules are simple whoever lasts the longest on the top of the roof wins one million dollars. <laughs> Alright folks, I want a dirty fight. I'm talking bad and kicking, scratching, name calling and choking. Oh, and no hitting below the belt. <laughs> Unless you really want to. Yay! We are now three hours into the contest with all eight contestants still in the game. I haven't been this disappointed since I saw that poster for The Dark Knight Rises. We. Why does this always happen to the guy with the cereal box? But we don't have a cereal box. When the time comes, Percy. When the time comes. And with that, Thomas is out! Kinda sad. You know what's even sadder? All this little runt has to do is get kissed by Noah and act like a little pervert, and girls just throw their panties at him. THINK ABOUT IT, PEOPLE! Okay, this is just pathetic. You told me that these guys would be at each other's throats by now. What's the deal? Wait for it. Did any of you notice how cotton candy smells like dental floss covered in peanuts? Well, that's all the stupid I can take.
Shall we beat them up simultaneously like we always do? Or would you rather take turns? Finally! But it still needs a little more... Oompa! Oh, I'll give you oomps. I'll give you oomps with a side of fries and nuggets. And ooh, would you like to try a combo meal? Yeah, I'll have a number 10 with a, uh... Uh... Come on. Uh... And a small soda? <coughs> Sorry, the answer was, of course, Larry King. But thank you for playing our game. Ah, uh, no worries, man. I'm actually a big fan of the show. And... <laughs> Wait a minute... Schnauzers had so much energy. Sweet! Now things are starting to get interesting. Come on, what's next? Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. Except for the fact that these schnauzers also shoot orange <laughs> soda! Oh no, oh, no. stop spraying please, us. Stop. Oh, orange we soda hurts us so much. This delicious ow, orange ow, soda ow, flavor ow, food. Like oh, please, that's not really the best we've got. Yay! Orange soda! <laughs> Soda. Although it does tenderize my skin. Oh, oh no, dog! No, dog! Oh, whoa, whoa! Who would have thought I have used that Wizard of Oz joke? James, do something! Hold on, I'll go get help. Oh, help! Police! Murder! Jimmy fell in the well again. My dog ate my cousin for the eighth time this week. Oh, please, won't someone help us? Well, I've done all I can do. I guess I can't say I didn't deserve it. Uh oh. Baby made a mess! Okay, this has gone on far enough! And then Whiff gets into this G huge battle against the Schnauzers. There's Kung Fu fighting, biting, and... Uh! I think Jackie Chan comes in at one point, then everyone starts having a seizure, and then finally the schnauzers fly off into space and take over Jupiter. Ha! <laughs> Your dog intelligence is no match for my garbage engine intelligence! Ha <laughs> With? Ah, yes! Oh shit! How could you? We had a deal! Yeah, I couldn't do it. Rejected! Ow! My chances are to a million! Wait, 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 wait. So if you die in the game, you end up here? Come on! Do something else! Really? Shut up! I'm on a roll! Ha ha! Chris and Toby's pitiful schnauzers are no match for the fact that we just duct taped ourselves to the roof. Ah, uh, guys, I think I duct taped myself to my butt! Yeah, I got no joke for that. So, remind me again, how is this gonna work? Simple. Have you ever seen a dog attack a piece of duct tape? Uh, no. Did I rest my case! Mm hmm? Haha, uh -huh. I am the Mighty Robotronic 50,000 AD version 2.1 Alpha. 
I come here to steal your magical green potato. Yoink. And now I fly away with my magical robot farts. Farts! Why does this always happen to me? Seriously, what do I look like to you people, Princess Peach? Avenge my death! <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, when you love what you do, it, it doesn't feel like work, you know? Am I right? Anyone? Alright then, so, you up for a coffee break? Sweet beans! Just as confused as you are. Sprinkle green! And I thought Twister had weird weather. Okay, at this point, maybe I'm willing to admit that maybe it's time to swallow my pride. Yo! What's your German joke? As much as it's going to hurt my livers to say it, I suggest an alliance between you and I in order to get rid of little Lord Cheese for Butt. Uh, yeah, hold that thought. <gasps> and why, and all my tormented, twisted little mind, would I work with you? Because it's either me, or him. Look what I can do with my lips! I'm the evil toilet paper and I'm gonna bat your face! Well, to tell you the truth, Marjolin, I think I'd rather increase my options! <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, I'm looking for Mr. Uh, James. Uh. Uh, I already told you, Warris Association people. I will pay my dues when you send me my free tusks. Uh, actually, you're uh, under arrest for uh, peeing on a Girl Scout and. Uh, a whole bunch of other stuff that escapes me now. Uh... Those charges were never proven! Hey, 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 what are you doing? Let go of me! Hey, you'll never take me alive, Cooper! I swear you'll never take me alive! Even though you currently are taking me alive! And when the crap did we get policemen? <laughs> did James really do all those things? Uh, sure? Uh-huh, I thought so. And then there were two! Wait a minute... Then that means... I won! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, have you heard the latest news? I heard the latest news! It was not I won! I won! Not yet, Mikey, my man! You still gotta beat one last competitor in order to win the Bamillion! <laughs> Boy! I've waited for Toy Story 3, I sat through garbage pail kids and lived, and I managed to not want to blow my ever-loving brains out after getting that Lady Gaga son stuck in my head over, and 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 over, 300 overs later, and over! And don't think I can't outweigh you and your unsuable butt. So I say, bling it on, sucker! Yeah, but you didn't see who else made it to the final two! 
Why? Who else besides me made it to the final team? <laughs> 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 Hey Mikey, what's a final two? Does it taste like chicken dipped in chocolate? Hurt me? <laughs> I love this game. A few minutes later. Hey Mikey, one of those little things at the end of your shoelace is called? I think they're called the pig pies or 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 or, or, or shoe dinglers or or or, or, or sneaky the booga. Oh, <laughs> How long have I been up here with this idiot demon for? Uh, three and a half minutes. Too long. According to our new arrival, life is more than mere survival, and we just might. And then, when I was at, my daddy taught me how to play football by covering me in tin foil and hitting me with a piece of bacon. And that was the best Thanksgiving I ever had! Plain, hurting, sanity, shittling, will, strong, mind, weak! She can't take any more like this, Captain! She's gonna blow! So there must be a large amount of stupid in the area. <laughs> All right, you smugs. I want the whole network rebooted and running under partially insane order. Hurry up! What do you think I'm paying you for? You don't pay me. We don't even exist. We're just a clever visual metaphor used to personify the abstract concept of thought. One more crack like that and you're out of here! No, please! I have negative no kids! Shanghai, Hong Kong, and Fu Young! Fortune cookie always wrong! That's the hard one! <laughs> I can't take it anymore! <laughs> <laughs> Gee, I'm throwing away a million dollars. But I'm happy! <laughs> I'm free! Free! <laughs> Another sad rebuilding sleepover. I'll get the popcorn. Now I know how to catch a feed. And that's why Mavis and I are dating. So let's never talk about this again. Ever! Wink! Uh, Chris here! Uh-huh! I see! Fine! <laughs> Looks like Mikey just met an untimely end! In a toilet! <laughs> I love my job! So, looks like Henry is the winner! And I thought Owen winning was shocking! Hey! Henry! <laughs> <laughs> no, stupid, it's just us again. But the good news is, you're the winner of Rooftop Stranded! I won? I won? Yeah! I won! <laughs>
So if Henry won, then that means we get custody of the Bavarian Dollar Check! Ha! In your faces! A voice clock pot in the wild! I gave about half my brain cells, my milk, and I slept with Helen Hunt for nothing! Yay! Oh, do we say you win a billion dollars? Yes, you said that, that is what you said, you said those words, you said. Yeah, we lied. <laughs> Bet you didn't see that one coming. No, instead, Henry, you win this one million year old potato chip. I think it's barbecue. Was barbecue. Yay! Potato crumbs! <laughs> All the sadness! All these tears! Actually, those weren't tears. But I'm not at liberty to discuss what they really were. You! All the stained pants! And for what? An old potato chip that looks like my Aunt Trixie! <laughs> Only without the mustache! The madness of reality TV! <laughs> Whoa, dude, this is more depressing than those animal shelter commercials. I know, I mean, hey, wait, how do you keep getting in my house? Because nothing sells reality TV more than broken dreams, false hopes, and stained pants. From all of us at Game Show Carnival, I'm your host, Chris McTrain, saying... It was his idea! Well, there's only one thing left to do. It's a dwelling idiot monkey! Yay! I love playing pitchfork! Gators. It's incredibly stupid! Can I get my paycheck now? Seriously. Yeah. Today's cartoon has been brought to you by the Animation Nation Army. Be tuned, get tuned, and stay tuned! Yeah!